President William Ruto is gaining popularity in the Pan-African movement and there are so many reasons why people are drawn to him and this is one of the examples. William Ruto just promised to abolish visa requirements for African descent who are planning to visit Kenya. This is great news because it allows free movement, it allows trade, it allows the sense of community that we keep talking about because the more you're allowed to go from point A to point B, the more you're going to do it and the more connections you're going to create and the more relationships you'll have with that community. Let me show you this clip, we'll come back and discuss. President Ruto also urged the 14 heads of state and government, 51 foreign ministers of the AU member state, and approximately 1,500 delegates to embrace a conversation to have a united Africa in order to better negotiate for the continent globally, adding that it's possible for Africa to rise on its own resources. Ruto further called out the developed world for what he called as discrimination when lending to Africa nations consequence of the transformative business we have assembled here to transact you will recall that as a continental political community we resolved unanimously to pursue the integration agenda with greater figure and focus this commitment was underscored by the decision to formulate a suitable framework to effectively coordinate the diverse efforts undertaken through our eight regional economic communities and various mechanism that is part of the ecosystem of the AU. I hope other African countries are taking notes so that they do the same because this is needed. Anyways fam, let us know down below what your thoughts are about this. I am Ongil Zalalem. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.